If you've been watching what's going on on the internet. Hmm. <laughs> With the last breath that I breathe, I say I'm the greatest. Real, nah, for real, nah, for real. You and you ain't on my love. I told the bitch I don't want. Let's go. Nigga, I'm a big this guy right here, man, been, hey, man, doing things that others have not been doing. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. One on one. Yeah, we gon' talk. If you've been watching what's going on on the internet. Hmm. <laughs> With the last breath that I breathe, I say I'm the greatest. Real, nah, for real, nah, for real. You and you ain't on my love. I told the bitch I don't want. Let's Nigga, go. I'm a big this guy right here, man, been, hey, man, doing things that others have not been doing. Mm. I watch this show myself because I actually do a lot of the editing and everything else, and I'm watching what's going on around the show. This guy right here, man, he's been on the show, but he's been continuously grinding, man. I've heard Greg Street. I've seen Snoop Dogg. I've seen Sway. In the more, I've seen Famous Animal TV, and I can, and the list go on. Watch this. This guy has impacted so many different people when he left here, man. That guy, my guy, family. Show is in the building. Hey, man. Yeah, I'm on Boss Talk one. Of them. <laughs> <laughs> man, thank on? it's you. Been, it's been a minute, man. Thank you for coming it back. It ain't been Ellen. that long. It's been, it's been long a while. Enough. It was December when you came up. I, uh, well, I'm talking about for my personal interview. It was October. October. Oh, it was October. I came on with Faison. It's another person. Big homie, nigga. That's what's up. Look. Nigga trying to get rich out this bitch. Fuck these nigga talking about. Big homie 3000 finna show him what that stuff about. In the I came I came back with a uh, slide fly, but mm -hmm. as far as me personally, I think it was like October. October. So it's been a okay, minute. Okay, okay. It's been a minute. And yeah. everything been going so quick for you. Like, you see, when God bless you, God has blessed you. That's a fact. I mean, you know, God's timing is always the right time, perfect timing. You know yeah. what I mean? So. Yeah, um, I wouldn't necessarily say fast. It seems fast to the outside world. It did. <clears throat> you it know? does. And, and faster than than most, but they don't. That's to somebody that don't know the backstory of what I done before. Big homie show. Yeah. You got to go watch the other Boss Talk One on One mm -hmm. interview to understand. Mm -hmm. We already mm -hmm. talked about the past, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, to somebody who looking at Big Homie Show, I can see why they would see or think that it happened fast. But now nah, it's a lot of years and a lot of tears in this shit. Because how many people ask you mm -hmm. that question? Because it's like all of a sudden you started rapping. Mm -hmm. Then all of a sudden, you know, people who start rapping, it takes them years to be on Sway. Mm -hmm. It takes them years to be on the shows that you already been on. Well, again, that's, that's, that's to somebody that has not yet looked up the history of right. Big Homie Show. Has anybody asked you? Uh, How? Of course. I mean, <laughs> you know, because everybody, you know, they see what's going on and they like, you know, oh man, what is going? You know, what would it take to get, you know, my campaign moving the way you know yours, yours is, is, or you know, and I don't mind helping where I can. I'm very upfront. Like, yeah. if you ask me uh, for a contact or something that I can help you with, I say, you know, I'm gonna reach out to That's them and, and and see what I can, you know, what what they say. Mm -hmm. And some of these things are just, you know, it's not a pick up the phone situation. It's just grinding and timing. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So. I mean, it's sort of like, you know, the same thing that goes on here. I mean, it's, it's grinding and timing. You can't that, just pick up the phone and say, hey, I'm finna go get a boss talk interview without putting, that's in, true. Without putting in no no type of grind because you true. ain't got nothing to talk about. You know what I'm saying? So, so how did you feel? How did I feel? Yeah, to see all of this just coming back to back. Because I know you probably got that call to be on this show first. Mm -hmm. Then the next call, just to see it coming like the way how it came. Man, um... I don't get nervous. I be um, I be anxious. So it's almost like it's almost like surreal in a sense because I be so ready to do it. You know what I mean? Like if I know I got something big coming up, I be ready to 
show that I deserve to be in the room at least. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And then you got this big bit. It's almost like a high. You got this big build up, and then it happens, and then I'm chasing the next high. I'm getting money. I'm getting money. Nah, for real. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.